Hey Collective, I am Luna Ray, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm here to do your new moon in Gemini reading. This starts from today, Sunday, May 29th, to um, Tuesday, May, hold on, May 31st. We want to see what messages uh, Spirit has for the Collective under this new moon in Gemini reading. Starting from Sunday, May 29th to May 31st. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective under this new moon in Gemini from May 29th through May 31st? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective for this new moon in Gemini from May 29th through May 31st? Sunday through Tuesday. Spirit, what messages do you have the, for the collective under this new moon in Gemini reading? Collective, under this new moon in Gemini reading from May 29th through uh, May 31st. Um... I just feel like it's some fuck shit going on and it's people like or a person it could be Aquarius Libra Gemini or this could mean you know this is going on during this uh Gemini season June 5th could be significant but I feel like under this new moon in Gemini it's somebody or a uh, people I feel like they doing stuff behind your back. I'm going to see what else these cards reveal. But y'all may have to check out my uh, Virgo reading. Um, Let me tell y'all what I have. I have the Five of Swords, the Page of Wands, the Ace of Swords, and the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Uh, So, Collective, what's going on under this New Moon and Gemini reading? Somebody trying to keep you and your partner together. Gemini does represent the Twins. So, um, this could have something to do with your divine masculine, divine feminine. I do feel like it's some, it's a karmic or just dark energies, like still trying to keep you and your person together. I mean, from not to keep from you and your person from, from being together. Y'all get what I'm trying to say. We still in Mercury retrograde, so that's why I'm stuttering, stuttering and shit. But, um, I do feel like it's somebody still doing things orchestrating things uh to keep you and your person together i heard so many ideas whoever this person is they have like a whole list of shit to make sure um you and your twin don't come together or you and your ideal person don't come together devil So, y'all, so this is some tea. Whoever's trying to keep your person from coming to you, this person could be using um, money, material. Somebody, this is the tea about this person. Whoever's trying to keep you or keep your family separated, this person is actually like a people pleaser. However, it's like they using being a people pleaser to their advantage by keeping your person away from you. Whoever this is, um, that's a people pleaser. I feel like they go above and beyond for your person to make sure your person don't come to you. Somebody wants to be like, uh, y'all remember that Rihanna song, Needed Me? You need, needed me. Like, that's how this person, they want to be like a lord and savior in your person's life collective. So, they just doing everything in their power to make sure like your person need them. So, your, so this person can always still be around in your person's life meanwhile this person knows like um i heard easily duped your person could be easily duped or easily persuaded or like it's easy to i heard brainwash your person i'm not going to say that's true but according to 
this karmic energy, like that's how they perceive your person. If somebody perceive your person like they're easily fooled or it's easy to trick them and it, it's easy to um, keep these people away from each other. Somebody feel like yeah, this shit is easy. This is a breeze. Somebody feel like they know what they're doing. And I, I do feel like this person know what they're doing. It's like they purposely, um, I heard volunteering to do things for your person. Whatever this is, it, it's toxic as fuck, collective. This is orchestrated to keep your person confused on like, okay, damn, should I stay? Should I go? Should I go back to be with who I'm supposed to be with or should I stay with this karmic or should I stay with this uh person that's always doing for me let me tell y'all all this is um uh, strategically done to keep your person off balance and to keep your person from coming to you y'all supposed to have a baby with this person and everything and if y'all do have a baby with each other or kids with each other y'all supposed to have another kid The thing is, your kid's supposed to be, um, like, four years old by now. Somebody been, like, interfering with your connection with your, your person for, like, four plus years. I'm going to say from two to, between two to five years, uh, somebody has been, like, a people pleaser to your person. And somebody confused, y'all, this is the T. So, whoever's trying to purposely keep you and your person apart, this person could say, like, I do all this for you. What have collective done? Collective not beneficial to you. And I, uh, I, I just do everything for you. And with this two of pentacles up and down energy, your person be like, yeah, they right. They do it. They do absolutely do everything for me. Collective don't do don't do nothing. And then the next day, but I really love collective. I really want to be with them. But I don't love whoever this is, but they do for me. So why would I leave them alone when this person's beneficial? Even though I want collective, but collective not beneficial. It's like this was strategically done. So your person can be confused on who to be with and who to choose and shit like that. But another mess I'm getting all this shit, whatever, all whatever's going on right here, like all this is childish ass shit. I'm not even gonna lie. This shit is childish as fuck, petty as fuck. And I feel like your person collected, they know better. But they still fall for temptation because I feel like it, it's so easy. Like it, this person makes it so easy for your person to wear your person like, man, it's hard to get rid of them. When I could just call them right now and ask for $2,000, they're going to give it to me. It, it's some shit like that. It, it don't have to be money. It can just be whatever. I heard you can have whatever you like. Somebody like splurge splurge a lot I mean this could be your person somebody out here splurge a lot but it's purposely done to keep somebody away from you period point blank but with this hangman out here I feel like your person on some shit like man I can get this shit on my own or I don't need no help from nobody. I can get this shit out on my own. It's something like that going on here under this full moon, full under this new moon in Gemini reading. Somebody coming out hard too. Look, I got this for you. I got that for you. 
And sometimes this person say they have certain stuff for your person just to get them to come over or to see them or to hang out with them or to it's something like that going on here. But that's all I have for this reading for the new moon in Gemini. Thank you. Bye bye.